everyone welcome back how are you guys doing this is going to be for Gemini's how are you guys doing gems I'm going to dive into oh my gosh just brought a little clock and I'm trying to figure it out but it's okay we're gonna just do that in a minute <laughs> um we're gonna do your no contact read okay um I just did your 24 hours so that's what I'm gonna gather right now and jump into your no contact read and see what we have through that energy and that space thank you Holy Spirit Holy Angels Holy Father Ooh, the lovers Ooh. the chariot in reverse want to show itself too all right so let's just see what this no contact read what this no contact energy is all about now if this does resonate go ahead and thumbs up the video here on the yt but if it doesn't resonate i will have your playlist links below in the description all right so let's just get entwined gemini's holy spirit holy angels holy father for gemini's energy what is the energy here for gemini's wow so look at the lovers <laughs> wanted to come out no contact read oh this is a lot this is a lot so i'm seeing this world here in reverse i'm seeing the breakup like this is still not lifted you guys like this four of swords energy like there's some kind of break here that was needed i feel like this person was affecting you mentally this is what's coming up here a lot of you could be dealing with a gemini yourself because i'm getting that twice i'm getting that within the world and within the lovers here so gemini aquarius taurus leo within the world and i'm getting gemini here within my hand i'm also getting gemini here as well within the magician in, re in reverse and also virgo but I'm just seeing like this person, there's an incompletion with you and this person. So for those of you who are like, is my person coming back? Yeah, they are. They are. If you're not in communication with this person right now, they are coming back. By just two things really from this whole reading, I just started it and I'm just seeing like, I'm seeing the lovers here, which is a temptation. So this person is misses, missing you physically, okay? They're it's like they can't help themselves at this point <laughs> and i'm seeing the incompletion so there are still messages that you guys need to receive or some kind of clarity or some kind of lesson that needs to be taught between you and this person but there is a blockage that is happening here i'm also seeing the ten of swords and i also have the strength energy Ooh the page of swords energy so there's a lot of cards that's hidden in this energy right here we have the nine of pentacles and we have the magician in reverse so i'm just getting a lot of jealousy right off the bat like this person whoever this person was for you gems oh my god they were so jealous of you from the page of swords to the magician and i feel like this person was jealous of you of your independence your power and the crazy thing is is the nine of pentacles for me is a very independent power and it's like i'm just getting like you are coming up like you don't need anyone but also you have this energy here too that is like a positive power like your belief system you know is corrupted here so i'm seeing like this independence in this way of taking care of yourself but i'm also seeing like this loss of, and this damage of this relationship and this negative outlook on everything that been created within this relationship hmm something is going to change for you guys because i just had this weird feeling that something beautiful is going to happen it's something exciting that is going to come for you guys because this was too much for you you didn't deserve this yeah look at that the seven of cups energy i'm also getting the king see look at that, that determination this change the success that is coming your way 
I just felt it. I, I can't explain that. And the Four of Cups here, and then you have the Six of Cups. So you're no longer waiting for this person, this person that you're no longer talking to. Like, you have it in your mind that, you know what, I just need to work on myself and, and just forgive, forgive myself. And you're doing all of that. I'm seeing some inner work being done. And it took a lot of strength for you to do this, but your angels are actually around you, helping you to heal, to release something that happened, not from this person really, but from a lot of things within your past to release that force of energy. And I'm also seeing the Six of Cups here where there's a lot of disappointment within this contract because I feel like this is a past life situation or something familiar with this person that led you to this person and this was a person that you had some kind of past con connection with as well. This is what I'm seeing here. Okay. Tell me more. Hmm. You know, you didn't know that this person was capable of that. And you're like, wow, this is a huge loss because this is someone from that you really trusted. I'm also seeing the Eight of Swords, the Two of Pentacles, and the Devil. So obviously this person, even though you guys grew up together or some kind of connection from the past, this person had a rougher lifespan than you did. I'm seeing like they have a lot of things to heal. You're in the process of healing, but this person has not. This person is still stuck in their past. A lot of you could come from the same environment, but this person just had a rougher time to accept that this happened to them. And they kind of dealt with this differently. And I'm also seeing fall into some kind of bad behavior. This could be drinking, sex, drugs. They're pretty stuck within that energy. And this is where the cheating came about. The Seven of Cups here. The Three of Swords energy is also being shown. The Hermit and the Moon energy. So there's a lot of secrets here. A lot of secrets in the present moment as well. Like you didn't find out everything that you needed to find out. But I'm also seeing the Three of Swords in reverse, you guys. So it's not like it's in the upright, it's in reverse. Wow, interesting. And then you have the Hermit energy. Where you're definitely trying to move on with your life. And make right decisions even though this doesn't feel right tell me more about this moon you're protecting yourself for some reason your finances your accomplishments tell me more this person is making promises but you have yet to see it yeah you feel like you're not a peer like you're not on the same vibration look at this the Three of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, King of Pentacles in the reverse. So something about being mean here. I don't know. Like your energy is just being like you're trying to avoid this person that is trying to build up their life. And for those of you, if you wanted confirmation on that, yeah, you know, this person is um, work to success. So you're going to go through a lot of trials and tribulations with this person, but they do have the interests of success, you know, being successful in the very end. And I'm seeing a lot of your doubt in that capability with the three of pentacles. You're doubting this connection. Tell me more. So something about this person doesn't make you feel safe emotionally. Because they drained you. You feel like they're using you. And this is why you're protecting yourself. Capricorn energy. A lot of you feel like you're pretty stuck and you've been played. This person needs to make a decision because 
I'm just seeing like they're losing their focus here. Like they don't know, they don't remember who they lied to or what lies they have made up. Whew. Wow. So you have the Queen of Cups energy, the Ace of Cups, and the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Ain't that crazy? Like I'm just getting a vibe like this person. It's like you want this so bad. Like you want this relationship so bad. You want this connection so bad. But I'm just seeing like this person's energy. It's like they're not making the work or putting in the work or trying to change something about them themselves. This is what I'm getting here. I'm also getting the Eight of Cups, you guys. The Page of Cups. So there's some plans with Hology coming in. And then you have the Two of Swords. So this is a difficult decision. This is what I'm seeing here. But it had to be made. There's a huge regret too. And this is why this person is coming towards you. I'm just seeing like whatever decision was made, you guys, they did not want to burn any bridges. They still wanted you in their life. So this kind of like turned against them because now you guys don't have any communication. This is a no contact read. But I'm seeing an apology that is needed. Tell me about this two of swords. Thank you. Wow, the Empress energy. They made the wrong decision. They made the wrong decision here. Now they have to tell you that. And they're moving very slow. They're afraid of you because you intimidate them. They want to move on with you. The Three of Cups. They want to move on with you. They want to celebrate with you. Tell me more. But they cost so much negativity within your life. Ooh, and some of you, you could be dealing with an Aries. Because I fell to the floor. <laughs> the Emperor. Aries energy. But there is an energy about this person that is quite determined. Success, success, success. Quite determined. And they're not going to give up very easily. But this is, needs time. Time for you to heal. Time for you to trust. I'm hearing trust and surrender here. Trust your divine God. Trust your angel guides. Trust everything around you, gems. Let's see. This person is confused right now. Why? Tell me more. Why is this person confused? Why is this person in the chariot in reverse? Like they don't want to come because of something. It's like they can't get to you. They don't know how to get to you. They're waiting for some kind of shift. They have to tell you the truth. They need an opening. Yeah, they want a happiness with you. But they're looking at you as a six of wands. A lot of you, this person could be watching you from afar because i don't see i can't say the six of wands is them because they're in reverse here they're not better in themselves they're watching you better in yourselves they're really just admiring you from afar and they're waiting for the spirit to actually get involved here they're waiting for some kind of breakthrough within this no contact yeah it's been too long there was some form of codependency for some of you could have been married to this person and there was some form of cycle but they feel like this is destined. The angels have not made a decision yet to break anything. It's about communication. So the angels are going to make a way. You're still open. But there's going to there's more to this. Let me see no contact read all right holy spirit tell me more about this person's feelings for gemini's no contact read tell me more about this person's feelings no contact read oh communications okay so they're they're receiving some kind of message New perspective. Okay. 
the emperor again aries energy you guys i'm seeing like they're determined to make something work here they're going to communicate with you they're going to have to because the message that they're receiving it's like they need to let this out they need to communicate this with you with their throat chakra i'm also seeing the five of pentacles Whereas a lot of like karmic effect, you know, this person left you with the five of pentacles and now they're going to have to come in and try to fix that. And with this, this emperor energy, this, you know, the shift, this, this strong force of energy, which is a success card, they're going to have to fix this five here. A lot of you, this person could have abandoned you when you needed them the most. This is what I'm getting here. And then you have the ace of cups. So clearly this person wants to be with you clearly they want a new beginning here oh they want this to be pure they want this to be a next level kind of second chance this is what i'm seeing here they want to fulfill your cup to make you happy to be the nine of cups for you to be your promises the promises that they made for you they want to be successful with this ace a huge force of energy that is coming through The magician this person is praying in praying for victory praying for breakthrough praying for abundance praying for love praying for your welfare something about this person's energy but they you when you think about them you see the four of cups like this person really disappointed you once before so it's going to be hard for you to see that this person is coming through this way. I'm also seeing the lovers in reverse here. So Gemini's, they're bringing you up that you guys are in reverse, but they look at you as the nine of pentacles. They feel like you deserve so much better. Like you deserve so much better. Tell me more. Look at that Ten of Cups energy. The Ten of Cups energy. They look at you as the home. The Nine of Pentacles. The stability. They feel like you don't need them. They understand that. They don't want to take away your power. They look at you as very powerful not if, even more than that they look at you as an empress but now it's like the ten of cups it's crazy they, they look at you as that happiness this is what i have for you guys let me just pull a card or two Let's see what the messages are. Thank you, Holy Spirit. I keep looking at this one. It says, your person, true love was right there in front of me. I couldn't see it. I was selfish to you. I don't know. I just saw this and I just felt like to read it to you. <laughs> and it's coming from your person. It says, true love was right in front of me. I couldn't see it. I was selfish to you. Wow. And I feel like exactly what this is, this person that's coming back. I'm seeing Virgo, Gemini energy for those of you who resonates with that or Aries. Aries has been coming up a lot as well. All right. So it says your person, okay, loved you first, but they couldn't let you in. What? But they couldn't let you in. So many things you don't know. What is going on here? It says, love you first. So this person loved you first, but they couldn't let you in. So they're talking about their family, their friends. So many things you don't know. You were being judged. Someone here was being judged because they're bringing it up. It's like, you remember that codependency that I saw? Like someone was whispering in this person's ears, even the three of wands energy. It's just been too long, but someone is still behind them. Loved you first, but they couldn't let you in. They couldn't let you in. People 
couldn't let you in. So many things you don't know. So they were trying to control something. The Seven of Wands who are being guarded. And I feel like they were trying to do this to protect you. But it's also, why am I getting like this person had many other relationships where people couldn't take things seriously? Or this person was in a relationship with someone else and they're trying to move on with you, but they didn't take you seriously. Their family, their friends talking about you. Okay, again, I look for you everywhere. I must. I miss, oh, I'm, I'm sorry. I miss the way you touch me. I look for you everywhere. I missed the way you touched me. So there's something physical going on here, an attraction towards you. I remember I said the magician, not the magician, the lover's temptation at this point. <laughs> Oh, wow. It says your person again. So this person has a lot of say, lot to say to you. Um, don't leave me. I won't find, I won't find better than you. Thoughts of you still lingers. Sorry, you guys. I suck. <laughs> I'm reading these cards, but it says, don't leave me. I won't find better than you. Thoughts of you still lingers. Okay. So they're still thinking about you dearly. So if you're worried about this person coming back, like I said, they are. If you're worried about this person thinking about you or not thinking about you, they are still thinking about you. Um, I feel like this person is coming towards you because of determination, how I felt within this read with the Aries energy, especially with the Aries energy. Okay, a lot of movement. This emperor don't play. And the emperor energy is in the upright and they are like really determined to fight for you and they see you and they're watching you and they're waiting for their right moment to get back into your life. So hope this resonates and I'll see you guys in your next one. Bye guys.